It might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Ew. Really? Well, by the by, he's not wild about it either. Well, brothers, I've been to many strange places, but this will be a new one. <laughs> yeah. I've never been in a giant's belly either. How about you, Father? Never one who was not trying to. You should expect that sort of response at this point. Where Odin hid your eye? No, it's not like I can still see through it. Yep, that's an eye. Maybe you should stick that in my head for safekeeping. Gently now, gently. Thank you, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone. Then we have all we need. Finally! We're going to Yudna! There's no stopping us now. Laddie, have you ever heard the term, tempting fate? So how do we get back out? We think... Hold on! What's going on? Well, that was mildly terrifying. Maybe our presence is upsetting Jormungandr's belly. No. Something is wrong. What's happening to him? Nothing good! Glad that's over. Is he getting hit? What is that? We must hurry. Couldn't agree more, brother. this what happened to him something we did no something else a dead giant why would the serpent leave us here look Trust her, right? Until we know for certain. Keep her distance. The world serpent. What's happened here? We hoped you would know. You are far from home. I'm looking for my son. The two of you. 
You helped me see things more clearly. You do not know where he is then? No. But the woods and fields speak his name. I know he walks here in Midgard. When did you see him last? Long ago. Before you were even born. Why are you standing so far from me? What's wrong? Something's happened. I had a feeling that hurting the big snake would bring the two of you out in the open. Do you have any idea, any idea at all, what you have cost me? My boy. Mother. I'm here. Don't run away. Oh, I'm not going anywhere, Mother. I know that you're still angry. I know that how you feel hasn't changed, but I, I want you... How, how I feel? How I feel? I've spent the last 100 years dreaming of this moment. I've rehearsed everything I ever wanted to say to you, every word, to make you understand exactly what you stole from me. But now, I realize I don't need you to understand anything. I don't need you at all. Back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do... This path you walk. Vengeance. You will find no peace. I know. You... I'll deal with you later. But family first. This again? You have to go! Please! Wanna turn away, boy? This won't be pretty. I won't let you hurt him! No boy. Fine. Stop! Ah! No! no! Atreus! You're bleeding! Breathe, boy! Breathe! Not my blood. <clears throat> I can feel this. Oh. Oh. I can feel everything. Oh, no! <laughs> He's vulnerable now.
We are moving. That arrow. Calder punch. The mistletoe? In the quiver strap, yes. The mistletoe harmed him. Freya said it was wicked. He's more than harmed. The spell is broken. He can be killed. I'm certain of it. It's all coming back now. Now he remembers. She's controlling that thing? Stay out of it! I can reason with him! No, woman! You cannot! He means to kill you!
this! There! Stop him! Even the All Father himself could not. I've never felt more alive. Ironic, <sighs> isn't it? Father, not a threat. You will not come to us again. You will not touch her. I don't need your protection. Stop interfering in my life! I was just trying to protect you! I wa <sighs> I've made mistakes, I know. But you're free now. You have what you want. 
try to find forgiveness, we can build something new. No. No. We can. Because I will never forgive. You still need to pay for the lifetime that you stole from me. I have paid. I have paid. But if that alone will make you whole, if seeing me dead will make things right, I won't stop. down every agony every violation imaginable upon you i will parade your cold body from every corner of every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell that is my promise he saved your life he robbed me of everything Everything. You were just an animal. Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change. And you do not know me. I know enough. Does he? Boy, listen close. I am from a land called Sparta. I made a deal with a god that cost me my soul. I killed many who were deserving. And many who were not. I killed my father. That was your father in hell. Is this what it is to be a god? Is this what it always ends? Sons killing their mothers? Their fathers? No. We will be the gods we choose to be. Not who have been. Who I was is not who you be. We must be better. Well, I guess we are the bad guys now. In her eyes, yes. But she could never make that choice. Hmm. We 
should finish this journey while I still have strength. I don't understand. I know saving her was the right thing. But she seemed all evil at the end. Not evil. You killed her son, lad. Her son. The death of a child is not something a parent gets over easily. But he was gonna kill her. She would have died to see him live. Only a parent can understand. So you'd let me kill you? If it meant you would live, yes. Look, there was no easy choice. For anybody, brother. But I think we can all agree you did the right thing. The world's a better place with Freya in it. Just give her time, lads. She'll come around. Back to Tyr's temple, then. One last time. Aye. Jotunheim awaits. I hope this doesn't cause you to explode or anything. Oh, hadn't considered that. Maybe we should talk about this a bit more. Nah, I'm sure you'll be fine. Ready? Oh, that's unpleasant! Now, boy! A word, please, before we continue. Listen, the last thing you two need up there is a decomposing heat ruin in the moment. Why not I wait for you here? This is between you and the boy. True. But if someone were to fight... My lady sifts soft, perfect sloshers. You done did it. Sorry. We had to see this. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, fine, damn it. Fine. Watch the head till we return. I can do this. No, no, I can't. Oh. Okay. Ready. Come. fingers I can see the highest peak ahead right over there we did it we did What are you doing? I have nothing more to hide. Can we go now? We're so close. Boy.
Hmm. Boy. It's nothing. I just thought I'd hear voices by now. What if this is all the giants that got out of Midgard alive? Not really many at all. Odin and Thor ruining everything for everybody. I should feel them, but I don't. This place is dead. What happened to them? Why'd Mom send us here? One question is answered, and two more take its place. bunch of giants she knew giants that's us the first time we met the world serpent but how and our fight with Balder but that just happened wait they knew everything that was going to happen. The dragon in the mountain. The stone mason. All these drawings. This is our story. No. This is your story. But... What does it all mean? That I was not the only parent with secrets. You didn't know. She was a giant. I'm a giant. Why didn't she tell us? She sent us here knowing we would find this. But... Why not just tell us the truth? Your mother would have had good reasons. Balder was never sent to find me. He was tracking her all along, not knowing she was only ashes. If she had a plan for us, I trust it. Whatever it is. Besides, she hasn't been wrong yet. Come on. We're so close to the end now. Yes. Yes, we are. Look. It's Mother's. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Let's finish it.
love you, Mom. The Giants. They really are all gone. There's nothing for us here. Come. So, I get that mother was a giant, which makes me part giant and part god. And part mortal. Right. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. My name on the wall. The giants called me... Loki? Loki? That's the name your mother wanted for you when you were born. She must have called you that to her people. But why? A question for another day. Let us go home. Time to rest. I'm gonna sleep through winter. Okay, this'll do. Sleep. Way ahead of you. Ball. 